Hey everybody, I just wanted to take a chance to talk to you about the latest update on the sink. Uh, I've done some videos on this mowing sink and I've had some issues with it. Um, <clears throat> the other day I went to Lowe's and I bought a mowing core puller, which is actually much bigger than the hole that is provided for the, for the thing to fit in. Um, I don't know why, but I got home and I started thinking about it and I thought, well let me try my local Ace Hardware store because sometimes they have a little different stuff to choose from. Sometimes in a big box store they just they, they have you know only so much space and they kind of lose focus. So went to my local Ace Hardware store. They had a smaller core puller and I thought, well that looks about the size that fits in there. You know, it's it's a little bigger than my thumb diameter diameter. And uh, I picked up one that was a little too small and it doesn't fit. It doesn't actually fit the hole. It's smaller than the hole. So I thought, okay, I need somewhere something in between here, but I don't know. I don't even know how to find out what product I have to find out what I need to fix it. Um, different websites, you know, are saying, hey, check your model number. That's it's printed on the thing underneath or near the base or no, it's not. It's not anywhere near any of that stuff. Um, I was voicing my dis my my uh, frustration with my wife. And she remembered, oh wait, we built this house in 2007. I picked out that faucet from the local place here in town, P.D. Wynn Nelson. She goes, let me give them a call. Maybe they have our file on, on, maybe they have us on file. So she gave them a call, she gave me a call, and she's like, all right, here's the deal. I talked to a guy named Van. He said, come by and see him. They still have our model in-house. And we can see what it is and actually pick out what you need. And I was like, sweet. So I go talk to this fella and he was super helpful. He actually showed me um, our model is still selling. Uh, it was on the shelf. Um, he was like, okay. He said, well, the good thing is you bought it from Moen, so they guarantee everything for life. I said, well, I'd always heard their slogan, uh, you know, on TV, buy it for looks, buy it for life. I said, but I never really knew what that meant. I mean, I thought, okay, does that just mean they're indestructible? And I was like, nothing's indestructible. Everything's breakable. He goes, no, 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 what that means is everything they make has a lifetime warranty. And he said, all you got to do is get in touch with them, tell them what you're looking for, and they'll send you the parts for free. He said, they'll probably send you the tool to replace it for free, too. He said, they're a really good company, and that's why we do business with them. He said, they are, they're they are one of the best ones out there. And he goes, I, I, I highly push mowing for that reason. I was like, oh, okay. Plus, they're local. They're, they're out of North Carolina, which is you know, right around the corner. Um, with us being in South Carolina. So, uh, he, he was able to bring it up on the computer and show me the model number and the, and the cartridge number and he said, you know, th this will be easy. He said, just, tell, just write down this information and give them a call. And so I, I took down the information. Let me just show you what I got here. Um, their phone number is on their website. Their website is www.moen.com. Um, you call the 1-800 number, 1-800-BY-MOEN, which is Two eight nine six six three six. They open at eight a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Um, <clears throat> I gave the guy a call. He asked me what year we put it in. I told him what the model was. It's an Eva two-handle widespread. I said I got the model number. He goes, No, I got all that. And he just, I heard him tapping on his computer. And he goes, Okay. He said, I'll, I'll get you what you need. And he said, I'll email you the directions on how to how to take the old one out and put the new one in, and uh, we'll have the other parts to you within seven days. Should be your 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 replacement parts and the tools to take it out and instructions. I was like, sweet. So, oh, and they have a callback service. So, like, if you call and they're busy, they say, hey, would you like a callback service? We'll just call you back, you know, in the next available, you know, uh, our, we'll be busy for about the next seven minutes. I think is what they told me. Uh, just give us your phone number. We'll call you back. So I was like, okay, well, I got some stuff to do around here. So I just left my phone number and went about my business, and they called me back within seven minutes. Talked to the guy. I was probably on the phone with him maybe three, four minutes. And now I got parts on the way for free because that's what they guarantee. Buy it for looks, buy it for life. I got to tell you, you know, I've done some customer service videos on YouTube before and talked about people who don't get the idea of customer service. Moen, if any of you guys are watching, you're doing a great job. That was awesome. That, that's the kind of experience that most people want. You know, I understand that, that some people you know, they, they want you to buy the replacement parts because they know they put out a crappy product, but you guys have built a quality product. You know, it's just one of those things where over time things do break, but you've said, hey, you know, you bought our product, we'll back it up. And that's awesome. So 
good on you. I just wanted to promote you guys and, and say what a good job that was. Your customer service was great. Everybody was really nice. I talked I talked to a guy named Tom. Very helpful. So even the guy selling selling your faucets over at PD1 Nelson, Van, super helpful. So whatever you guys are doing, keep doing it. God bless and uh, Merry Christmas. Thanks for watching. I'll keep you guys updated when I get the parts and show you guys how I end up replacing it, okay? If anybody's concerned or interested. So thanks for watching.